currently changing Natalie, and I'm just like untie, 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 strip down, put on your other outfit. And you can definitely tell that the models that were backstage and everyone backstage was like, what the f is happening? Like, this shit's insane. I finally decided to do an expo, and what better than a Quintana.com expo because Quintana.com and El Clasificado have been there for me ever since the beginning. This is our booth, guys. This is our booth. We got roses for the Yeah. Yes, sir. You asked me how if you haven't watched our custom. Our custom. And we're ready to make your dream dance happen. Going into this, I was very scared in a way because I was like, I've never done an expo. I don't know what I need to have at the booth. But I did know for sure one thing that I needed to stand out from all these other vendors. We are gonna go hand out roses to the future quinceañeras that are here at the expo. We are very excited to see all of them. In my perspective, I'm not even thinking so much I need to get clients. I just need to put these boys on stage and have them do the performance. It's definitely a good place for the AC boys to get out there more and book more work. We're here, bitches. Back the fuck off. Tell us about your quinta. Like, what are you planning on having? Are you gonna have like a ranchero theme? Are you gonna go all out and have like enchanted forest? Like, what are you looking for? A ranchero theme. Ranchero theme. What color do you want your dress to be? Uh, it's gonna be green. Oh, green. Emerald green or sage green? Like an emerald green. Okay, period. That's just gonna look good on you. Now, what are you most excited for your quinta? Other than renting the boys, of course. The party. The party? Are you are you a big party person? Yes, I'm so if I have all the boys dance with you right now, your party? Let's go dance, go, come and dance, dance with her. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. What's up guys? We're gonna go check out Boots and see what's up. And we're, we have flyers just in case. I wanna go visit. Oh my god! Oh my Jesus! Oh my god! We gotta be backstage. Oh my god. Are we gonna perform already? Yes. What time is it? Three. I thought we were performing at 3 30. Yes, so we have to be backstage in 10 minutes. We're not gonna practice that on? No. Oh, he's, he's saying. He was trying to say that he was your best friend, and I was like, that's my best friend. Sorry, I'm working right now. Oh, oh okay. You just changed the topic. I'm gonna pretend like I didn't hear that. Yeah. Thank you, thank you so much, Lolis. This is our amazing friend over at AVM, right next door to AC50 Choreography. Now you look so pretty. My inspo look for Natalie is extra big Texas vibe. Big hair, beautiful makeup. Big shout out to our hairstylist, Gabriel, and our makeup artist, Noelle. And our dress, of course, from Moda 2000. She was a real life Barbie. And I feel like that's what people were going up to her like, you look like a Barbie. So I met Alfredo when we were like, I don't know, I think it was, it was a while back. I've known him before, AC, AC, literally everything. The first project we did together was the first campaign, which was Bring Me the Night. It's so crazy to see that first campaign compared to now that he has the boys and stuff like that. In the beginning, it was literally just me and him. I love looking back at that because it's just like how we started and just like our relationship to begin with. It's really, really cute to look back at. I think the big difference is just like, him in general, like he just seems so happy and accomplished with himself and I'm just like so proud of the person he is. Compared to now, now he's the one teaching everyone else and giving people opportunities to do this. It's, it's really, really inspiring to look at. Are we ready? I'm ready. Are we ready? I'm so 
excited. We're gonna kill it. Here, you ready? You ready yeah. to kill it? Here. Today at our performance for the expo, we have a, a waltz that cuts right into a surprise dance. You know, it's just a lot of high energy stuff for the surprise dance, but the waltz is very like technical, so it shows everything that we can do. I'm looking so nervous because I have to change Natalie in the middle of the dance. All my heart is racing 100 times per mile. Is JJ oh, okay, to go? guys. Is JJ allowed we to go with ice spice? We go as soon. Whatever. No. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, hold on. Have fun. Yes. Everyone out there is dying to see you guys. They've seen your look. They've seen how Natalie looks. They've seen everything you do on social media. So go out there and be like, this is what the f do. Yes. yes have yes, fun. Sir. It was a big projection, it was not just, we're gonna do a waltz, and then we're gonna do a surprise, and it's like, no baby, we're gonna show you a show. I always pair Natalie and Diego up because of the chemistry they have when they dance. You need to be comfortable with your dance partner. You need to have that trust within your dance partner. He's such a good dancer. Like, he knows what he's doing. He's super confident with what he does, and I just, he's so clean with it, too. Like, hello, like, props to him, props to him. Oh, it's really cool, because she's been around us for so long, so I feel like she's, like, grown with us as well. And, like, being able to, like, dance with her, it's really cool, because, like, you know that she won't mess up. She knows like everything that has to go down, so it's really cool. She's AC, AC girl, AC queen, everything. I'm currently backstage right now watching the dances and all I hear is people screaming, like yelling, carrying my boys on. And that's what it was, I don't know, like, I wanted to cry so bad because I was like, those are my boys, like just watching them on stage, like those are my boys, that's Natalie, like this is my family. Currently changing Natalie, and I'm just like untie, 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 strip down, put on your other outfit, and you can definitely tell that the models that were backstage and everyone backstage was like, "What the f is happening? Like this shit's insane." We're almost done. Ready? Work. You got it. Okay. Kill it. People were living for Natalie. They were living for this look. They were living for this performance. Like the whole like teasing throughout the whole expo led to that performance, and everyone was just like in love with it. If I had a quince, I for sure would have had all the boys. Like I always tell Fredo, I'm like, why didn't you have them sooner? Hello? Like I would have begged to have like maybe like a 16 or something. If I would have known, I would have definitely loved to have Diego as my chambelan. <laughs> I think it was the highlight of the whole expo. Like, people were talking about it. I get DMs saying, like, we literally stayed until 3.30 p.m. to watch you guys perform. Like, you guys are the ones that sold this expo. And it made me really happy. Were you guys the best dancers in that building that day? 100%. We were the best performance. 
and we stole the show. We were having auditions saying, Aaron's replaceable. I was so disappointed in him. How are you going to come in here and forget the whole dance on the spot? I really don't want to talk about it right now. <laughs> Some boys aren't coming back. Bye.